Come on, Lily. Let's take out some of this be these vegetables out. Yeah. Ooh, look at that. See? That's a radish. Oh. <laughs> you want to help me pick some? Yeah, we haven't been out in the garden in a while, huh? Yeah. We should pick a salad out. Look at that. Ooh, that looks yummy. Yeah, put it in here. Okay. Whoa, there's a humongous one over here. Can I see? Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, these are overgrowing. It's almost time to do the spring the spring garden huh mm -hmm. what are we going to grow this spring water. <gasps> look at this one this one looks delicious yeah it does it kind of looks like a carrot like a carrot they do grow like carrots right mm -hmm. that's how carrots grow they grow in the ground i might have a radish salad they grow on the ground. You have to pick them. Yeah. Oh wow, that one didn't make it very well. far. Let's see what happens if we put it back in. Some of these are babies still. Ooh, there's a humongous one. Look at that. That one's very pretty. Whoops. Boop, boop. Wow. Oopsie. Let's go check the other one. Oopsie daisy. <laughs> what are you eating? Um, candy? Yeah, candy. Mexican candy? Yeah. Well, some of these didn't grow very well. This is, some of these are overgrowing. As you can see, these are already flowering. I might cook this tonight. Look at that. Okay. I'm gonna cook that tonight for dinner. Those aren't as big as that one. Let's see what else we can pick for dinner. Split. <laughs> hey guys, just decided to come out here and pick something for dinner. I'm going to be making a little radish salad with some salad, some lettuce, and I'm gonna try to cook this pot chop I think it's called I'm terrible with names so I'm gonna attempt to cook this and see how it comes out oh, it's been a really nice day and I've been thinking a lot about my garden today uh, I have tons of ideas I made the decision of putting some trees in the ground this season coming up because I want to be able to have productive trees that give me enough to share with my family and friends and right now the containers besides the uh, Mexican key lime the other trees are producing enough for my family so they're perfectly fine in containers but if I want to share with family and friends I definitely have to put some in the ground and what I'm gonna try to do is grow as many trees as Belair near a wall um, because I don't have any room so I'm gonna try to grow them against the wall and see how well they do and uh, actually 
I need help with making a decision and I'll make a completely separate video for that. But for now, I just wanted to come out here and harvest a few things and share that with you guys. I know I haven't made that many videos and um, I miss you guys and I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm still here in the garden doing my thing. Just haven't had the moment to upload and record that many videos. But um, I hope you guys are having a fantastic weekend and I'll see you guys in the next one, okay?